Well, hi, everybody. Hey, did you notice the trend in drive through restaurants that you don't just pull up, place your order, and then pay, and then wait a few minutes or a couple of seconds sometimes, because it is fast food, and they hand you your food and you drive away? No. What happens now is you pull up, you place your order, which you got to do quickly. They want you to place that. There's no such thing as looking at the menu. They want you, you need to know what you want before you go in. God, oh, God forbid you're not sure if you're in the mood for French fries or something different. They want the order right away. Okay. Then you pull up and you pay. And then sometimes you go to a second window to pick up the food. But now what they do is when you get to the second window, they ask you, oh, would you mind pulling over? There's a couple of parking spots over there. Would you pull over and park and we'll bring the food out to you? Now, I noticed this years ago when this trend started. And I'd be like, I don't mind waiting. Oh, no, but you, could you please, please, sir, please pull up over there and wait. All right. Now, you know that fast food places are very concerned with the amount of time that they take to complete an order. You can see the You see the timer. As a, as a customer, I see the timer up in the corner. And then there's little things you can read on the wall where it says, oh, we have to cut back the average time by one-tenth of a second. We're way too high. Oh, we're taking too long. We got to reach our numbers, get everybody in and out faster. So as a way to make the numbers look better, they have you pull over in the parking lot and sit there and wait for someone to come out and hand you your food. You know... I'm sorry, but it's it's annoying. This is not convenient. Is this convenient to the customer? Is it convenient? It's convenient to have a drive through right? I'm in a hurry. I'm in a hurry. I want to place my order. Maybe get a Big Mac. Whatever. It doesn't matter. Something from McDonald's that's supposed to be there, right? It's McDonald's. It's fast food. Burger King, fast food. drive through convenience. All right. I'm just grabbing something quick. But every single time now, this is the thing, every single time they ask me now to pull over. They even have parking spots that have a sign in the parking lot. The sign says this spot, these two spots are for drive through customers only. Well, guess what? If I have to pull into the parking lot and park, I am no longer driving through. What is going on here? They're crazy. They're crazy with the numbers. They're crazy. They're, they're in a hurry. They're in more of a hurry than me. Now, if I have a special order, believe me, if I have a special order and I know it's going to be a long time, I don't mind pulling over and waiting. It's something special. But if I order something, even number, I order number one, whatever it is, it's a, it's a double quarter, a quarter pounder with cheese, French fries and a drink from McDonald's. Quarter pounder with cheese, french fries, and a drink. It's a combo. I give them the number. I give them the number. I'll have a number one with a diet, please. So I have streamlined the order process. I pay with a credit card. Zing. One second. Cash-free society. No money. No money is transacted. No cash. No cash is handed from the wallet. I'm not waiting for change. And they still automatic. It's automatic now. Let's face it, folks. It's automatic. Oh, could you please pull over? I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. If I order something different, something special, I'll be more than happy. But just to keep your numbers artificially down, that is not convenient to the customer. Am I the only one? Am I the only one who feels this way? Ah, I can't be the only one that feels this way. All right. That's all. My rant is over. Have a good day, everybody. Have a good day. Have a good day.